Uh, please uh, tell us something about the evolution of prices on the MTPL sector in the last few years and uh, which uh, do you think will be the trend uh, over the following period? The developing of the premium in the MTPL is uh, for the, such a huge story. Uh, since the 2001 or two, after the demonopolizations and uh, between the 2005 when the price was uh, still partially regulating, the prices was growing. But after the liberalization of the uh, full liberalization of the markets, uh, the prices was uh, relatively stable and uh, go down. I think that it was the a result of some kind of the uh, price war and also uh, by the, some uh, com competitions. Uh, but in our legislation, it's a requirement for the adequate premium. That's, uh, I think that the company tried to fulfill this criterion. And if we uh, analyze the uh, trends in the claims, I think that for the future we can estimate some small growing of the premium. You mentioned in your presentation um something about the number of uninsured vehicles that are, is rising as a consequence of the financial crisis. Can you please tell us a little more about this trend? Uh, I don't want to tell that it's exactly only the reason of the financial crisis, but financial crisis could have the impact for the growing of uninsured car. People try to uh, save the money in the all uh, potential field, uh, where is it possible? Uh, but I think that's positive impact for the solving of the topics of the uninsured uh, cars could have a more efficient database and more efficient system what we have to do something with it.